I want to get some few CV Ramans from your institute. In the case of space technology, India was not too far away when it launched the first rocket from its soil just six years from the dawn of the space age. Ingenuity of the men, women of India have helped us to realize the Atmanibar infrastructure from near zero infrastructure. You can see from the slide that the global aerospace market is of the order of 340 billion US dollar and India is the third largest civil aviation market. The global space economy is about 360 billion dollar of which India share is just 3% which is a huge opportunity. This is the reason that the government of India has introduced a slew of reform in the space sector, allowing private players to tap this market by allowing them to build launch vehicles and satellites and also launch from the country. How long do you think it will take for us to achieve this uh, total self-reliance? Every success is uh, having an equal percentage of failure also. The high risk matter, so definitely we will be able to come out of this is at the earliest with the type of that reform we brought. Just we would like to know about the program of Chandrayaan 3 and Mangalyaan 2. Chandrayaan 3 that uh, the program is going very well and the deficiency we observed in the Chandrayaan 2 from the last phase of the mission. Now we understood that the corrections we are taken in the in the Chandrayaan 3 and the Mangalyaan 2 we are in the process of made defining the project and we are making use of that opportunity to give the, uh, the opportunity for the students or the academicians and uh, industries to bring that uh, new science payload so that we can uh, do it in a very uh, effective way and utilize the, the features for the nation. Uh, what about Gaganyan mission sir? Gaganyan uh, is a very very complex mission and it is a higher, it is the biggest project that is so has undertaken ever and uh, this is the one the project it is not only ISRO and ISRO, industry, academia, other organizations in, in, in India and international organizations all should equally should contribute then only the mission can be success and it is going very well. How we could be able to uh, uh, collaborate more uh, in, uh, or we can work very close with ISRO. Uh, as a UPS and ISRO collaboration, something like that. The proposal come from that uh, universities or academias. We are really analyzing and if it is that, uh, going to be useful that we want them to do that uh, thing and the response program is one program is very much open to the entire country. You give your brain and I will give my power.